It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. A sorting ceremony? Well, yeah, sure. Let's let's stop messing about and start focusing on what's important, yeah? the sorting ceremony. Okay, that's good. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, All right. I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Yeah, actually. Okay, that kid did not seem happy. Phineas Nigellus Black. Phineas! <laughs> okay. Prepare yourself to meet. Bit of a coincidence. The headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. Okay. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. Okay. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. An unfortunate coincidence by the looks of things. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Yeah, that... That's weird. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? A little? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain... expectations. Oh... Uh, I can't wait to start classes. I can't wait to explore! I... I mean... I mean, I'd like to look... Do a bit of exploring. Explore. I mean, it looks like an amazing place, but I'd like to start the classes because I'm going to get taught lots of cool new things, aren't I? I want to explore. I want to do classes. I want to... Uh... Okay, I may be a tad indecisive here, but you're giving me some good options. I... Okay, you know what? Look, let's be... Let's be a good student. I want to, I want to start classes. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. Okay. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. 
a certain sense of... Hmm, what is it? I don't know. We're daring. Okay, I mean, I, I, I could be daring. I've been daring. Curiosity. Definitely curious. Loyalty. I mean, loyalty is a good thing, isn't it? Loyalty is a good ambition, you know? I mean, yes, you should always... I mean... Now I'm curious about if this is important. This is probably important, isn't it? I think I'm curious. I'm definitely curious. I'm absolutely 100% I'm curious, so... Yeah. There's no option for trepidation, is that? Little bit of trepidation, because I've got a talking hat on my head, but I'm going to go with curiosity. A desire to learn? I do enjoy a good puzzle, and I believe I have a ready mind. Mmm. You're clever indeed. Thanks you very have much. the ability to reflect clearly on that which puzzles others. And you've a ready mind, quick to learn. Perhaps you belong in Ravenclaw. Okay. The sorting app will take your choice into account when sorting you into your house. Raven House, known for intelligence, creativity, and wit. That's me. That is totally me. I am definitely intelligent, creative, and filled to the brim with wit. No pun intended, Mr. Hat. Um, no, no, that sounds good. That sounds, that sounds great. Is that the emblem? I like that. That is cool. And that's important. At least I think it is. Anyway, yes, no, that sounds good. Okay, did I choose wisely? You belong in Ravenclaw! Okay. Well, okay, people keep doing that. Oh, we get a different tie. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Right. Soon. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. Okay. I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honour to show you to your common room. Right this way. Okay. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I am, Professor. This is the entrance to the Ravenclaw common room. You must solve a riddle to enter. I won't be of much help, I'm afraid. This sort of thing has always confounded me. Who lived longer? The ghost or the poltergeist? A ghost or a poltergeist? Hmm. A non-being can never have been. Yeah, poltergeists were never alive. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go in and go to sleep. No, seriously, that's what I'm going to do. 
I need to go around and poke everything and... How can I sleep when I'm this excited? Ooh. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Or... Counter suggestion. Let's explore a little. A hat and a jacket. Not really my style. Don't really look big enough for me either. Appleby arrows. Is that a poster for a broom or are we going to be shooting arrows at each other? I mean, I'm okay with... Oh! It's a Quidditch team, isn't it? It's a Quidditch team. Yes, it is. Okay. And this is a box with a thing above it. Probably has a technical name. Awesome. Ravenclaw Quidditch player, probably? The Seeker? Okay. Odd selection of furniture, really. And my God, the mirror could do with a clean, couldn't it? I mean, look at that. Actually, to be honest, the paint could do with a touch-up. I'm not volunteering or anything, but don't we have spells for that? Reperio, Restorio or something? Just everything looks shiny and new. Apparently not. We got an umbrella stand, though. Do we need umbrellas? Surely we can use our wands. Ooh, first choice. Downstairs or upstairs? I'm gonna go upstairs. And, oh, good choice, I think. You can test me. Go on, test me. Okay. Whoa. Just have to wait for the right moment. I'm guessing I'm not allowed to go that way. Okay. The common room. Okay, I'm right here, and I have ears. Okay, I'm twiddling with a globe. I'm not sure this is the right spot. What for a plant? Seems like the perfect spot. Can I have an apple? It's a can. No, it's it's a good spot. I want him to be in the perfect place, a place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cosy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I have a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wigan World Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. Yeah, he's quite... I wouldn't really know. No, he is very knowledgeable. The practical magic, it's, it's a matter of experience, actually. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganweld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. That's true. Nice talk. Oh. Do most students grow their own ingredients? Isn't it Hufflepuff who like plants? <laughs> Can't we all like plants? I mean, I know they've got a thing for plants, but... Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. Okay. 
Out of curiosity, isn't this more of a Hufflepuff thing? Not judging, though. I'm all for trying lots of different things. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Okay, you could say that. Might I suggest you don't? I mean, I appreciate the attempt to joke, but... Anyway, yeah, no, it was definitely nice talking with you. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your ditany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Yeah. Okay. Can I look through the telescope? No. I can probably twiddle... Why do I now have this odd urge to twiddle with every globe? Yeah. It's like I started twiddling one of them. I now feel morally obliged to twiddle the lot of them. Never a dull moment when I go home for the holidays. Last year, my mother swore she heard a banshee. She couldn't sleep for fear that one of us was doomed. My older sisters taught me everything I needed to know about Hogwarts before I stepped foot in the castle, including how to sneak food from in the kitchens. That could be useful. I was semi-expecting the bus to start. All right. Deep breath. Why, hello. Would you like to take a look? Actually, yes. What are we looking at? Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Wait. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I thought we I were take it keeping you that a secret. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Okay, I find I've never been one for stargazing. No, 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 no. Stars can be cool. I hope astronomy's on my schedule. Sounds interesting. I have good news for you. You are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. I see a lot of pleasant people around here. I can't believe the professor told me to keep everything quiet and has already told everyone about the flying lizard. I probably shouldn't mention. Yeah, and I got it. Wait for the right moment. Not allowed to go that way. Okay. All right. One moment. Watch this. Ugh. What is this? Okay. Someone threw a dumb box. <laughs> Let's get out of here. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. So everyone knows. Okay, I'm a tad nervous. No, I'm actually, I'm pretty damned excited about this. I'm glad to be here. Ready for classes to start. Good. Glad to hear it. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I wasn't I mean, nervous. not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Yeah, how would they possibly... Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. I'm sorry, who, who was that? Please tell me it wasn't Ignatia Wildsmith. Hello? I'm supposed to meet someone outside. I'm not supposed to leave them. 
waiting. The professor. Professor Weasley. I don't actually know where outside is, so... Okay. Ooh! That is... Our house's namesake, isn't it? Yes! Okay. Should probably get a, a move on. Is this the right... Whoa! Direction. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls. Owls. Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. <laughs> they will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Okay. Here you are. It's a book. I mean, it's a cool book. Okay, it's a very cool book. I don't know what it does, but I love it. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise okay. to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. I will be very wise. I love my pockets. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay. Okay. This way. The statue's here with the, with the whole... The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Okay. Can I Revelio while we're walking around, or is that considered rude? I probably shouldn't do it right now. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Yeah, it is very cool. Oh, sorry, did I nudge you? Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? Okay. Revelio. Collect. Ooh! Ravenclaw bust. Guide pages. This bust, created in honor of Ravenclaw House, resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. You've just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Okay. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Okay. This is your wizarding level XP earned from challenges increases... XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Like it. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. How do I select? Oh. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Discover field guide pages around the world. So wait, there are pages of this book scattered all over the world for me to find, or more likely, the book will fill pages in for me as I experience things. Unless someone just took the book and ripped pages and hid them everywhere, which is absolutely ridiculous. And yet, somehow the sort of thing I would expect. Okay. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete for appearances to critical upgrades. Collect two field guide pages in Hogwarts. One of two. Gear appearance reward. Oh, so I get some more... Ooh, I get stuff. Who doesn't love stuff? There is not a person alive who does not love stuff. Well, there probably is, but they're probably not coming to Hogwarts. Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts. Got it. 
Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you've unlocked. All right. Oh. Okay. So is it okay if I just... Rebellion. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities oh. like that, inside and outside of the castle. Oh, okay. There's stuff to basically prod at all over this place. I mean, is it rude? I mean, am I allowed to just... No time to waste. Okay. You've classes okay. to attend. Okay, fine. I will, I will stop doing that. I will stop doing that. Hi. Okay. Why is there a question mark here? Revelio. Oh, Professor, I, I just... Okay, I'm, 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 I'm gonna stop. Sorry. Yes, I will mark that down for later. So. Ah, good timing. Oh. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Flu Your flames. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay, you've discovered a flu flame. Fast travel point. You can open the map at any time to fast travel. Got it, opening the map. Okay. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house common rooms and the great hall. Select the grand staircase region to continue. So I can do it over here or there, okay. The Magnificent Staircase of Hogwarts. Okay. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you've discovered, including your own house common room. Grey flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Can I only travel to the places I've discovered? Sort of like I know them so I can visualize them kind of thing? The right side of the map is where you will find academic points of interest, including the Astronomy Tower, Library, and Greenhouses. Select the Library Annex region to continue. Professor Weasley has unlocked the Central Hall flu flames for you to rotate them. Oh, use these to rotate the map and fast travel to the Central Hall flu flames. Is it this one? Central Hall. There we go. We're going to the Central Hall of Hogwarts Castle. I kind of want to walk around a little bit as well, just to get to know the place. And here we are. Okay. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Oh. You can get almost okay. anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Ooh. Hall. Sorry. Oh, this is very cool as well. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Good analogy. I dropped one of the crystal balls in divination. Everywhere. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay. Can you tell me more about charms? Can you tell me more about absolutely everything? Let's start with charms. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Okay, and what about Defense Against the Dark Arts? I mean, I don't want to sound too excited about that, but I kind of am. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of defense against the and dark arts is required them. for those who aspire to become auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Okay, and Hogsmeade. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. 
You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Butterbeer? Okay, well, thank you very much. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much oh, to yeah. learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. Okay. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Oh. Uh, oh. Ah. Uh, okay, I really don't want to lie to her, but he did say... Okay, um... Well, you should probably ask the professor about that. I... I... I, I was injured after the dragon attack, so it, it was all a bit of a blur. Um, so... Yeah, that's pretty much all I remember, clearly. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Oh, she is so not buying Speak it. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. Oh. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Oh. Good luck today. And remember to She's use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. Right. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. What? Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Yeah, I, uh... Okay, what did she mean the book would keep her informed as to how I was... Is she going to use the book to spy on me? What sort of trouble have you got me into? It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I wouldn't say masterfully evade, Professor. And I'm not all that happy about lying to her, to be honest. Mostly because I think she's rumbled us. Um... So, yeah. I did try to evade her questions, though I feel a little deceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And okay. she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, sort of. as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the that. benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Uh, okay. Opening the map. All right. This represents main quest. Complete the main quest will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Got it. 
Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be required level or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor assignments or as quest rewards. So I need to sort of do quite a few assignments for professors to get all my spells. Makes sense. Okay, track a quest. What have we got? Charms class. Defense against the dark arts class. I don't know which ones I want. What have we got here? Rewards. A Accio? 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 Fit right. Professor Hecat's class in the lower section of the astronomy wing. I could get lost in this castle. I may need to use the charmed compass in the field guide to help me find the way. And this will give me Levioso. Isn't it Levios? You know what? Let's let's just track that one, shall we? Oh, okay. I've tracked it. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll oh. enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Right, totally. Got it. Okay. Pass charmed compass. Okay. The charmed compass will lead you to anything you're tracking. Okay, will it? Attend defense against the dark arts. Okay, how exactly is the charmed compass leading me? Anywhere. Oh, right. No, it's not hold. Got it. Ah, okay. Right. That is sort of cool. And quests. Defense against the dark arts. Charms class. Let's see where that is. Back up this way. Oh, that is going to be exceptionally useful, I feel. What else do we have here? Quests. Complete. Main quest. Gear appearance reward. All right. Collections. Oh, I can find things. Appearances. You have collected seven of 86 things. Right. A skull mask. Doesn't seem like the sort of thing you would want to wear around a college, to be honest. Kind of in the way a little bit as well. Dark arts robe. Oh, definitely want to be checking out some of this talents. Inventory. I don't have anything worth talking about. Gear! Right, okay. Can I change cell value? Change appearance? Okay, I probably don't want to be changing the appearance in the middle of um, a station. Yeah, that's that's probably... Well, I... I suppose I could probably do it magically. I tell you what, let's do that in private first and make sure it's done magically. I don't want to just start dropping my trousers in the middle of uh, a public area. And neckwear. Do I have anything for the neck? Natural beige scarf. Um, no. No. Definitely not. Okay. I definitely want to get some more combat magic learned. But honestly, I'm not totally sure what this charms class is going to teach me, and not knowing is kind of driving me a little nuts. So honestly, I think... I think... I think I'm going to go there. Yes, I do. Okay, so... Oh, 
also useful. Oh! Rebellion. I should remember... What are those things on the wall? My sister's always wanted There's to something in there. I just know it. She's always after the latest fad. Okay. I think you might be right. Hello. I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. I love the way you think. Have you learned anything about it? Are there any other paintings? Are there any other paintings like this here? Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Right, okay. What have you learned about it? Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Lumos? Okay. Do you mind if I have a look? If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Lumos. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. <laughs> illuminating. Bit of a joke going on there. Lumos. Okay. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay, it's definitely some stair and some whatever the... What is that? Rebellion. Okay. Oh, what is... Okay, I cannot help but notice I am now going in the opposite direction to the one I'm supposed to be going in. Whoop. Okay, would anybody mind if I started poking around in... Okay, perfect sh shirt and tie uniform. Oh, please tell me I can get out. Okay, bit of a relief. Rebellion. Okay! Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. New here, don't know my way around. What? Okay, that definitely looks like a lock. Level one lock. I'm guessing I'm not supposed to. I didn't try the lock. I accidentally stumbled on it after being startled by a noise. Okay. Um, yeah. So there's another place that looks like that. It's got a, let's have a look. It's got a column with kind of, I don't know, sort of organic pattern around it. All right, I'll keep my eye. Oh, oh. Just like this. Just like that. Okay, so is it in this area? Oh, I am so going to be late for class. I am so going to be late for class. What on earth are these? Okay, the other one changed to a unicorn's head as well. You know what? Before you start doing stuff like this, you probably should find out what's going on. He says, continuing... This looks like the location from the painting. I was gonna say... What could be so special about it? Oh, I see you. What, what, what are you? Okay. Rebellion. Come on, what... Alright, let's see what this is. Statue of Gregory the Smarmy. This statue, with an ingratiating grin, depicts the medieval wizard Gregory the Smarmy, the wizard famous for inventing Gregory's unctuous, unctuous unction, a potion that makes the drinker believe whoever gave them the potion is their best friend. Okay. Oh, I've collected. I've completed a challenge. My. I enjoy having lunch down Potions classroom. Flu flames location. Okay, so this is the potions classroom. Good to know. What are you up to now? Nothing. Totally nothing. Um, where, where, right, so. 
This is this is the area I saw, and there is this. Can I? Lumos. Oh. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh. If I put my light away, will this moth go away? Yes, it will. Ah. <laughs> stopped. Perhaps I need to keep casting Lumos on it. Okay, so now I just take you to your frame. All right, look at this. Look at this. Um. Oh, look, there's a butterfly on the frame. Okay, if I do this. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should oh. tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. I will I will definitely do that. I will definitely Whoa! It... Okay. Right, it disappeared. Yeah, I will definitely tell she was yellow Hufflepuff, right? I don't know where I'll find her, but I'm potions required precision. But transfiguration makes potions seem easy. Right, anyway, um, I was heading in that direction. Rebellio. Okay, I have no idea. What's that? I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Ignatia Wildsmith. Her likeness is placed all around. Oh, right, no, Lenora. Have I, for some odd reason, got that quest? Oh, I did. I somehow decided to. Yeah, okay, you know what? I will talk to you. I will talk to you before I head to class. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I followed the clues. I'm not telling. <laughs> I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. Oh, you have a knack for solving riddles. Matty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. I've met. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. Okay, well, glad I, glad I could. The moth. I should have seen that. What? Well, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm a very clever Rebellion. person. Or at least I'm, I'm a very persistently nosy person that likes to figure things out, which is kind of clever. I mean, really, where the hell am I going now? I'm not currently tracking anything. Uh, uh, right, yeah. Um, Charms class. We're going to Charms class. Assuming we don't get distracted on the way. 